Hello everyone, now we're playing some more Zero Kings 2, continuing where we left off with the playthrough as Pride Nation of Lithuania. If you've recently you've been able to form the proper kingdom of Lithuania, and are on the way to forming in your religion as well. Which is why I have set up a Google form that you can view in the, in the, in the panels that are on, the, on Twitch or if you're watching on YouTube it'll also be in the description. And uh, as I'm playing with the Holy Fury, which means that uh, 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 we get a select from all of these options when we finally get the 750 piety we need to reform. Just we'll be stopping the stream once we get that uh, enough piety. So this may actually end up being pretty short stream well once we get the piety and still have and have the 50% more authority we need which can drop down by at most 20 We provided that we don't lose any of our holy sites somehow. Sure, I mean that would, that would be a far greater, uh, be a far greater setback than than the, just you know our previous ruler dying. That's pretty much the only reason we aren't already ready to reform. This previous ruler died and and lost it. He lost all that piety as a result. He's also got a lot of dangerous factions. Yeah, we need to do something about those. Let's see. We have a plot, we have a plot. For any of them. Currently members of factions. Yeah, she's only got a 23% chance of successful imprisonment. So as useful as getting the head of a faction would be... Don't think... Maybe it, it'll be that... Maybe easy... No, like it'll, I don't think it'll be worth the risk. Let's, let's perhaps see what this guy's problem is. Short reign, foreigner, cynical versus zealous, and religious religious differences, and too many help old duchies. Let's see maybe Maybe I can grant some of my held duchies these two new vassals at the same time I'm also above my vassal limit. Well, 
I mean, it only negatively affects the amount of taxes and levies that you get from vassals. Let's see. Alright. Grant this guy. Six. Bring somebody the High Chieftain of Pomerelia bring some 60 he, he opinion and boost it. So maybe you can grant this guy He a he high chiefdom and that'll get him to stop being a new thing like this. Or not apparently. Because he manages to still have to still be at minus five. But they've also dropped down to thirty-four percent and thirty-five point one percent of of we Asian huge in terms of uh, they're actually like we actually think no that's the same guy let's see anybody still getting still getting too many held duchy duchies these penalties, so let's grant the other faction leader, the High Chieftain of Pomerelia, and so now neither of them actually dislike me. Like the only reason they're leading factions against me is likely they don't like me enough for some reason. Right. Let's see, do I have any vessels? Walls I need to satisfy? Nope. Alright. We're already off to a pretty good start to or when it comes to improving piety as as it King Jodela is is zealous, so he gets plus one piety per month from that, although he does lose some because he's lustful. He's also got good learning. As a master the theologian, as a scholarly theologian. And so. Oh, he's gonna. So I were generating 2.36 mixed piety a month. So the current rate it'll be let's see Oops. Do some quick math. Let's see. We need 431 more, more piety. 431. Five by 2.36. It's about 
divided by 12, about 15 years. So, not, not a terrible rate, honestly. Like, apparently if you raid it, raid it, raid it infidel temples, not only does it boost it, lose moral authority, it also boosts it, lose piety. Is it grants about 1 to 5? Native according to the wiki. Which is also an event. There's also in the an option under the intrigue the tab. Yeah, I believe it's the Ovens Festival that is it grants it. And it's piety because it is a religious event, and I'm pretty sure. Gonna stomp out the these raiders first, then go on my own raids. Come on, quit running away. Finally got him. Great Seljuk. In the steps of Central Asia, a great warrior has emerged as the leader of the Kinnik tribe of the Orga's Tusks, of the Orga's Turks. Demonstrating his brilliance by winning the war against it, he made Shah Abbas of the Hominid Hid Shadom. Other tribes have taken notice, and warriors of all stripes are flocking to his banners. There was in great numbers. Seljuk Khan has, has promised them a fortune in, in plunder in his river conquests. Turkish Khans come and go. I guess there's the conqueror now. Like the far away from here, so not really much, much of a concern. But let's, let's pause and try and find it. Nice temple to raid. Here we go. Run Sandomir's. And and we missed May, so can't hold that that event this year. We're gonna have to wait till next time. Then can, to my knowledge, you can do it every year in May. Yeah, might as well. So stop up people from conspiring against us. And to my knowledge is every May you can hold this festival. 
That should grant some piety there for us. I could let hear someone sneak around inside and believe it to be a burglar. When I went downstairs, I, I discovered skirt regular opening one of, of my letters. Either game the trick cruel or lose three prestige and he isn't helping practice reading. I'll do that. And apparently one of our vassals is declared to the Lithuanian conquest of Pinskun and High Chief Vladimir of Turov. So right over here. Which I mean, it doesn't have that many troops. So maybe this one vassal will actually manage to manage to conquer something. I mean, over here we've got a province that was taken from um, the then from the Scythia of all, all places. Just goes to show that she, vassals can do some pretty impressive things under the right circumstances. Alright, we fully raided the, the temple here. Then move on to the next one. I want to keep an eye on on the calendar. Make sure that March uh, May doesn't pass us by again. Almost May, so pause it when it reaches May to make sure that I get that to that whole whole festival going. Invitations have gone out, out to your vessels asking to join you in the Spring Music Avenues Festival. Mm. We've decided to make the, the festival this year a special one, remembered by uh, both spirits and men and for many years to come. Let's begin preparations. This, this random chief has decided not, not to uh, to join, which is Slavic, so that makes sense. Same with this guy, and this guy, and this one, and this one. Perhaps I should. Cause I believe Eve converting young people also lets you piety, but I might be thinking of. Of your opinion, verse that's four. Let's see, need council sessions. Yeah, it's gonna start proselytizing. The vessels have arrived and in the time of the Scavenging East Festival is, is upon us. A large effigy representing winter is burnt in a, a symbolic fight is staged between Lacinus, who is the winter spirit, and 
Kind of, kind of, this is spirit personifying spring to everyone's light. Need to kind of, kind of, emerges most victorious as always. Take that, let us in this. The winter effigy continues to burn outside, hastening the, hastening the coming of summer. Her younger ves vessels gather over the great feast the servants have, the servants have prepared. So, well, let's drink together. Vessel opinion increases by plus 15 for, for the next year. Or you move inside the, the large feast hall. You also gain money from them all of this rating as well. As well. Right. Can't upgrade Majesty. So I'll go for his Majesty would do upper monthly piety gain as well. So I'll just up something else. The effigy has finished burning, the spirit of Lysinus has been in defeat, and the feast has come to an end. Your vassal is are returning home, but most, most seem to agree neither the has gotten enough in this, this festival. It was well worth the trip. Until next time. So, all of these people get plus 10. All the people I attended get a plus 10 relationship with me, and... I gain 100 prestige and 100 piety. So, more events like that, and we'll be able to get to have any piety in no time fly. This, this way is like. She just kind of, you know, I'm going to tell you, uh, uh, as you serve the title of Chieftain of Pen, the title Chieftain of Pen, High Chief, New Vladimir of Turo. Oh, so now, now Pensk is part of her kingdom. <laughs> as uh, the Chief just was successful in her conquest. Right, we finished reading that, t uh, that temple. Fortunately, there's another one right nearby. And we do have to get through these guys. Like, we outnumber them by about four times, so... Not much of a concern. Yeah, we can probably, if we can keep gaining 100 piety a year just by spending 50 gold. Oh, now we have new, new mark in the kingdom as well. As Chief Gardenus of Slupsk has usurped the title of new mark from Count Bo Mosadar of Lassen. We can keep gaining just like a hundred piety a year, but just paying fifty gold gold every May, then we'll be able to reform in like three years. Provided that the king doesn't like die from this this illness he has right now or something. For now mostly just like waiting for this raid to finish.
Like we're we're also still gaining one point seventy one then then piety also we can gain more by helping out like helping out our, our high priest he's in chief this this here <laughs> we might as well like help spruce up help the of it of the the holy sites let's see building a temple here and the durga that uh, will upgrade will increase piety to lead used by a point five well point oh five See, Chief does let's thank you of the Inquisitor of Kalas. It's not actually providing us any piety, possibly because. There's a Kalos, which is her, her, her capital, has been looted. <coughs> and also, there's no temple at all there. <coughs> we can also worship the ancestors, which I think also grants piety. Let's go for. Gang my sword in battle. And sacrifice this random I'm a, I'm a prisoner. I think hmm. Was it an outright state that I granted us any piety? Right that the temple has been sieged. Let's. Well, raided, I mean. I mean, they're basically the same thing, only one happens during the war and the other doesn't. Let's head on over here. Can we not raid this place? Don't think we can. We've got to go over here. There's somewhere that's not currently he he siege down um, by another person. <coughs> Alright, so now we did get Oh and we and we missed May. Because I got uh, distracted again and wasn't paying attention to the end of a month. <coughs> We've got to wait until next year. Like, we could very well get the piety we need in the next two years anyway. Like assume, assuming nothing happens, it causes us to like lose a whole bunch. As much as it's not contributing a whole lot, the temple raids are helping get our moral authority back up to the 50% we need. <laughs> We lost some of the bonuses we've had. We 
on purpose because oh and the king just died fortunately the new king actually has more piety <laughs> conveniently enough You're not sure. Become a paragon of virtue, despite being possessed currently. He's unmarried. So let's try and find someone. If you're like someone that can boost learning. Could go for the priestess of Hostro. Oh, it got decent traits in 22 learning. So sure, we'll, we'll lose 200 there for seat just because she's a lowborn, but she's a well, she's a very he learned learned to live long. Need those options and improve her, her prestige. Oh, well, or piety, I mean. So now we're at negative the prestige. We're getting two point sixty eight. We're getting getting about three. E piety per turn. Really? How, how many preachers do I have to imprison before you guys will learn your lesson? And we don't we don't want the word of the Christian God here. We're trying to, hang it, to organize as our own religion. The religion we've been following in successfully he, he for generations. So Need a new spy master. Gotta deal with all these infidels. I feel like you, you know. Crushing an infidel uprising should also grant some piety and moral authority, so. You now it. That'll just sort of be a bonus. Alright, so we can pretty much get. Can just about get what we need come May hey, because those will be able to get possibly like a hundred uh, uh, piety oh Is that granted piety and I guess like one point of moral authority, so <laughs> guess we've just got to read, read one last temple. There's Nope, that's not a temple, that's a castle. Here's one. But it's also a pretty big, powerful nation. 
Let's go for an easier target like the one right over here. Like once, unless something happens, this can be the end of the stream, uh, the CK2 portion of the stream. And once we raid this temple, well, because I'm planning on, well, this, I'm just gonna save and even switch to something else. Once we get the requirements for reformation. <laughs> and because... Uh, that way there's time for people to vote in. And the poll I've got set up, up for it. Uh, because I'm gonna have this just gonna leave that open until well next time I stream this which will be next Saturday just gotta like we've got the moral authority we've got three holy sites need to so now we just need to Need one new, one point of moral authority. It's mostly because one of our temples got looted earlier. That that we don't already have all the moral authority we need. I think they might have to go through like multiple castles and possibly he, he like a city he before they he reach he, he reach the bishop of the this her gone Right, so siege. I think they're onto the city of Kakath. That is now. Yep. It's currently being, unless it's being looted. Which it also says right there. Let's let's give that guy a nice title. Let's see, Canis Borka, this of Lithuania. We could, do we change? No. Huh. I have no idea why he's suddenly being called a Canis. Even though I'm pretty sure we don't have. Canistry as even an option. Unless I knew oh, that's a completely different thing from Agnetic Eldership. Who Chief this over here can have a gift. Granted, I don't really need to to boost my, my piety gain right now. Other than like fulfilling it. I think the king's ambition to get 2,000 piety. Let's see. Alright. These two who kids need, need education focuses. This kid. Good learning. 
and a good trait for learning, so... Oh, well, let's sit. Let's have a focus on learning. And this kid, which is also our heir, has good traits for martial and good martial. So you can start a martial education. Just as soon as this temple siege down to believe we are in the process of that. And yep. And there we go. Believe Yep, religion can be he reformed. So that's that's gonna do it for her Crusader Kings 2 this evening. Is I'm gonna save actually reforming till next stream name of this game. Name because that way reform thing. You can do it at the beginning of the stream, but also you know, that way I don't have to no worry about it. Also, that way, you know, I know there's time for people to vote in the, in the polls I've got set up, and, and I don't have to risk, say, losing a bunch of piety or losing a bunch of moral authority or something. So, I'll be right back with something else, I guess. <laughs> and I'll stop and restart stream once I get it set up. Thank you.